Hi, I'm Boy. The day I wandered out of the monster world through the closet door, I began to explore a wonderful new world. Your world. The world of humans. Here I can learn all kinds of new things, meet new friends, share silly jokes, and follow my dream of having my own show. Welcome to the Boink Show! Hi everybody! It's me, your host Boink, with my friend Caitlin and Avery, and we have some special guests on today's show. In fact, we're coming to you live from their farm. Caitlin, can you introduce our guests? This is Adia and Tara. Hi. Hi! Hi, Adia! Hi, Tara! Hello! Where are we? Can you tell us a little bit about this place? Uh, we're at an animal sanctuary. Yeah, animal sanctuary. What's it called? A uh, Little Acorn Farm and Animal Sanctuary. Wow, really cool! Well, that's actually going to be our word of the day. Can everybody say word of the day? Word, word of, of the day. day! Sanctuary. What is a sanctuary? We know what animals are and all that stuff. What's a sanctuary? Tara, what's a sanctuary? A uh, sanctuary really means a safe place, and here it's a safe place for animals. Oh, well, that's wonderful. So these are these just normal animals, or are they rescued, or what? They're, some of them are rescued, like the two way over there, but oh. all, the chickens and the goats are just, they're just pets. Wow, you guys must be really nice if you like to rescue animals and, uh, and help them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, that's something we talk about on the show is kindness, how much it matters. You guys are putting kindness into action, not, not just with humans, but with animals. So tell me a little bit about some of these, like, you, you've got some uh, animals around here that you've given names to, and, and tell yeah. me a little bit about them and what it's like to care for them. We named all of our pets. We have a bunch of chickens. We have 11 chickens and four goats. 11 chickens and four goats. And growing, sounds and, like. Huh? And growing, yes. <laughs> now, where do you, you say you rescue these, where do you rescue animals from? Uh, we rescue them for different farms, and one of them, it was... They, they were going to kill the two chickens, <gasps> but then we saved them. Oh, that's great. Yeah, that's really great. So what, what is it that made you want to rescue animals and take care of them? Because that's a lot of work, I bet. Mm-hmm. Well, we started with two dogs, and we okay. loved them so much. And then we got a couple of chicken, chickens, and we loved them so much that we wanted more. Yeah. And then we went to the Minnesota Zoo and met some goats, and then we really wanted goats. But we also (laughs) know there's a lot of animals out there that need homes. Um, So we we wanted to help some animals that didn't have a a safe place to be. So we took in some animals and and gave them a safe place and loved them and cared for them. And we're going to get a new barn. We're doing a fundraiser right now to get uh, two goats a barn, and the others have this. How can people find out about your fundraiser and and what you're doing here? Do you have a website? Uh, Yeah. What is it? On Facebook. We have oh, a Facebook. Facebook page. A Facebook page. Yes. Okay, that's always a great way to get it. Mm-hmm. Bump Boink has a Facebook page, and I'll, I'll put the link on there, about, and then people can learn about it from us if they see it on our show. Oh, very nice. Okay. Well, great. Um, so, goats. Tell me about goats. What's so fascinating about goats? You said you like dogs, but then goats. Mm-hmm. Goats are a lot like dogs. They are. Yeah, they, um, they sometimes remember their names mm-hmm. if you don't you. have a lot okay. of them. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, like Tucker and Riley, they're normal goats, but our other two, one has a problem with its legs. It sh- has shorter legs, and then the other one is blind. Mm-hmm. Let's see, are they are they naughty ever? No. What? Only, only Tucker and Riley. <laughs> they are naughty. Only Tucker they are and naughty. Riley. They are naughty. They chew on things. They like to chew kids' hair. Ooh. They like to chew off your shoelaces, and they like to chew clothing. And sometimes they eat things that they're not supposed to. Yeah. Oh, monsters our, do that too. Yes, goats, I've heard that. Yeah. Our goats' <laughs> names are Tucker, Riley, Pancake, and Martin. I don't know where Pancake is right now. He's wandering around. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, let's cut to some footage we took earlier of us going around the farm and meeting some of the animals, okay? So here we go. We're going to show you what it's like to uh, to be on the farm here and take care of some of the animals. <laughs> Darker, darker chickens probably, one of the buffs. Um, they all sleep together, but the egg, it has little spots on it. And then we take it out of this, and then we sell them or we eat them for breakfast. We used to eat them for breakfast, but now we sell them. So. can't see. He's 
totally blind. And the other goats think he's different, so they had to pick on him. So he's kind of separate. So Hagar, this is Ophelia. She lost one of her eyes. It was either, well, she probably had an infection and then a dog attacked her and he took out some of her feathers. So she's done that and then, yeah. She lost her eye right here on the side. So do you do anything special to take care of her? Well, yeah, we've had her in the house for like a month. So this is dark meat. That this is, is Elvis. This is Bok Bok Chicken Bok. She's holding Elvis. And who picks all the names for these chickens? Uh, we, we all do. Well, that was really cool. Thanks for giving us a little tour of the, of the farm here. Do you guys have any jokes? Because one of the things we love to do is a joke of the day. Hmm. Do you guys know any good jokes, like a goat joke or a farm one or something? I know a chicken one, but it's, oh, yeah. it's, it's, it's really common. <laughs> it's why did the chicken cross the road? Why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other side. Yeah. To get to the other side! <laughs> <laughs> it's a very obvious one. Mm. Yep. That's a good one. Any other farm jokes that you can think of? Tara, you got to mm. have a good joke, don't you? Um, what did the goat eat for dinner? What did the goat eat for dinner? Everything. Oh. Everything! Oh, everything! <laughs> everything. Yeah. I was going to guess like shoelaces or kids' hair, because that's oh. what you were saying. Oh, yeah. They but, like that but they just really like yeah. everything. Once they like everything. An, once other visitors came over and it, Tucker took off the guy's shoe, the plastic of the tie at the end. Oh, no. <laughs> so he ate that. And the kid Don't, was Did like, goats what? ever what eat that and like do? get sick, or are their stomachs really strong? Um, they, their stomachs are kind of sensitive, but yeah. usually what they do is they chew it and then they spit it out. Oh, okay. Yeah. So they... They can digest a lot of things easily. Yeah. The old, the, they used to say goats will eat a tin can, which is, they'll chew just about anything. But Ooh. luckily they don't swallow most of them. Okay. Yeah, they just spit it back out. They spit it back out. All right. And the chickens, you know, they're pretty well behaved? They're, they're better than the goats. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you get eggs from them. We do. We yeah, get. we sell them and we eat them. Mm -hmm. Okay, very yeah. cool. Well, thanks for being on our show today and, uh, and having us come out to your farm. It was really fun. Caitlin or Avery, do you guys have any questions for them? Um, what is your favorite chicken? Uh, we like Elvis. My favorite chicken is, I think, my favorite chicken is Buttercup. She's a rescue chicken and she limps. She needs lots of love, so we give her lots of cuddles. Yeah, and I, I named her that, and she's kind of like my chicken. Mm -hmm. Avery, do you have any questions? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Avery's our kind of quiet I one. I have one. She loves to be on the show. Yes, what's your question? What's your favorite chicken? My favorite chicken is probably Buttercup, too. Buttercup. Because she sits on my lap. Yeah, mm -hmm. she's a calm chicken. Mm -hmm. I think it would be hard to pick a favorite. They, they, all, they all look really cool. They are all very cute. And me and Brooklyn can... Remember all the names. I really liked meeting um which which goat is the one that's blind? Martin? Martin. Martin, Martin. he just he seems is, adorable. Yeah, he's in Martin's, his tent right now. Yep, Martin is kind of the favorite because he needs a lot of extra care, but he also loves to cuddle because he can't see and he feels safest when he's with his people. Oh yeah. So he really loves people. Very cool. All right, well, thanks for coming on the show. Let's all say goodbye to our audience and remind them to check out the Little Acorn Farm and Animal Sanctuary on Facebook, okay? Thanks for coming. Thanks, yeah. everybody. Thank Bye. Bye. Bye.